Hello everyone, this is Jack from OneSite Solutions. Today I'm going to show you how to commission and deploy a Mac 36. We recently have had quite a few queries come into our support team requesting assistance on how to commission a Mac 36. And as you may or may not already know, the Mac 36 requires certain core modules to be able to initiate the startup of the device's operating system and will not allow for commissioning if these are missing. You do not have to do this for every ISMA device, but for the Mac 36 the core files are necessary. We also have a wide range of ISMA devices on our website for you to check out too. In the description of this video, we have a download link which will install these separate files. Below that link is a compatibility chart which will tell you which, which installer you need for your Niagara version. Once you have downloaded the file, you'll see this. Inside here is separate file installers in comparison to your Niagara version. So I'm using Niagara 4.12.2 So this will be the installer that I need You simply just go into the installer And you can run the application I've, I've obviously already done it so I don't need to extract it And this will automatically deploy the files and the disk files that you need for your ISMA device If you are running an installer that is not supported to your build or the file installer was not successful then you have to manually deploy these files into certain locations of your Niagara directory, which I will show you now. The first set of files you want to copy or drag out are the modules. Simply copy or drag these three modules out of the downloads file and drop them into the modules folder of your respected version of Workbench, like so. The next set of files you will need to copy are the cleanest files both from the cleanest folder and from your version of Niagara. For example, I'm on 4.12, so I'm going to head into the 4.12 folder and copy out these files. Then all you need to do is go to the same directory in your version of Niagara, go to clean dist, just drop them in there. I've already done it, so I'm not going to replace them. The next set of files you need to deploy are the clean dist files inside the clean dist folder. Simply copy these out and drop them in. Cool. Now we can jump on Niagara and proceed with the commissioner. And to be on the safe side, I would advise anyone to run a clean distribution on the Mac 36 with the new dist files we have just deployed. This is essentially a remote factory reset and basically put the device back to its factory settings while keeping the set IP address, which you may or may not have already changed. To do that, just simply go to the distribution file installer. Again. Once your distribution file installer has opened, you can simply go ahead and click on this dist file, the NRA Clean ISMA BMAC 36 v2.0. This is what we have just deployed in our files. Click that and then click install. Once you have cleaned down the Mac 36, reconnect to the platform and go through the platform wizard. Just going to quickly go through this. Give myself a username. password finish that once that is done we can right click on the platform go to commissioning wizard here you can configure your commissioning so I don't need to add these and your license manager Runtime profiles and then your station copier. Of 
copy every file. Normally you would have no files in the software installation, but the file installer we have just used managed to fix that and replace the software installation. So you can go ahead and install whatever you may need. Just for the purposes of this video, I'm just going to go through next. And that is done. There we have it. Our Mac 36 is now going through our commissioning process. If you have any further questions or queries, please contact us at support at onesite.solutions. It will be in the description below. Thank you very much for watching. Any feedback on this video will be greatly appreciated. And do not forget to like and subscribe.